the LEDs on the top of the dash, yeah. they'll go from row of green, row of orange, row of red. When you get to the top of the row of red, that's 13.5. If they start to flash, you're a split second too late, but it's no big deal, it's 13,500, which is where it's set. Now the side lights, six LEDs on the side, they're red. Any of those come on, hit the switch, shut it off, pull the parachute. Yeah. Picky, picky, picky. Yeah, yes. well, we're happy about that. 6833, yep. Just like last year, it'll come back to you. Yep. It's just exactly the same as last year. Yeah, Everything's the same. Cut stays on here now. Right. Yeah. Right. yeah. Don't rev it. Yeah, and don't rev it. It's very different to other cars. A normal car, you drive them and you can feel them. But this car, you can't feel anything. And I've only driven it four times before. I'm going to drive it today. I'm very nervous. It's going to be a shakedown run until I learn how to drive the car and what the car feels like. This is number uh, 6833 making another test run. They're trying to get this uh, V10 Judd Formula One engine sorted out here on this machine. It's a three liter Formula One engine. Reg Cook from Papakura, New Zealand. It's still going at the two and a quarter. Go! That's the three! I was a bit nervous. Uh, the first part of it was as Kiwi Steve says. Uh, finding the gears and matching stuff, you've really just got to keep pushing buttons. But once it got going, it hauled ass, it was so stable. It's a, a speed machine that can be very dangerous. I'll, I'll sit in there anytime and that thing will, I'd run through five miles, 300 mile an hour, whatever it can do. I'm not going to be frightened of it. And how do I feel about the car? Brilliant. Am I ready to drive it? I'm inexperienced. I've got to get some more experience.